Hey there living jet sir as well. I'm in Dubai mall and the newly opened Chinatown. Super excited because I have a very special video coming up for you guys. Well, I'm making my way inside Chinatown here in the Dubai mall. It is absolutely beautiful. You have to come and experience a Chinatown here. But we are not here to actually visit Chinatown per se because I am really hungry and I'm in the mood for some Michelin star food. Well, what if I tell you that the world's most affordable Michelin star food is right here in Chinatown in Dubai Mall and that's where we're heading. So I'm at Hawker Chan right now here in the food court and I'm going to get myself some chicken and some duck and apparently it's the world's most affordable Michelin star meal. So I'm not going to break the bank on this one. Let's go and quickly order my meal and let's see how it is. So I'm very excited. Um, I wouldn't say it's my first Michelin star meal because remember if you check the earlier videos we had visited uh, a Michelin star restaurant in Bangkok. So I think this is going to be my second. Hi, I'm going to try the soya sauce chicken rice, the medium and the roasted duck noodle medium. Well, I've just placed my order and let's go get a table where we can sit and enjoy this delicious meal. Order is here. There you go. Oh, look at that. So that's the duck. Yep. No, that's the chicken and that's the duck. Looks really yummy. Well, first I'm gonna try the chicken uh, with soya rice. Let's see how it is. I'm gonna get myself a nice piece of chicken here and some rice. And let's see if it's really Michelin star worthy. Is it Michelin star worthy? Well, it's tasty, but I don't know if it's like Michelin star. So that was the chicken. Let me try the duck now. The duck with the noodles and you have some like spicy sauce along with it so let's see how this one is let's try the duck first the duck is really good it's a bit sweet with the sauce let's try some of the spice with it oh that is spicy <laughs> that is really spicy well, the duck has some barbecue sauce on it and that, that's what gives it a nice sweet flavor but it's really cooked to perfection and very good and even the chicken uh, is on the bone but the chicken too is cooked beautifully that was my opinion i have my very good friend arlo j singh with me who's also an influencer and works in dubai here so let me ask arlo hello how do you find the food not so interesting for me it's no, there's nothing, it's just combination of sauce, that's it, nothing else. Well, I think he's not a fan of Michelin star food, <laughs> but at least he's giving his honest opinion. How is the chicken? Yeah, try the try, chicken. Mm, it's fine. <laughs> chicken is more fine. It's good. I don't, I don't think he liked it. <laughs> I actually think he is not a big fan of it. You can see this is like a brown egg. Yeah, it's a brown egg. Let's, let's taste the egg. It tastes like an egg. Well, some quick facts about Hawker Chan. Uh, Hawker Chan actually got the Michelin star in Singapore uh, in 2016. And this is just like a branch of it. Uh, the Michelin star still holds for the restaurant chain. So that's why you can actually say that this is like a Michelin star food. Uh, would I recommend it? Um, dicey. It's just like any other normal food according to me. The chicken has bones in it which are actually crushed so that makes it a little tough to eat and it's not too comfortable. I would go with the duck. I like the duck. So the duck is a thumbs up for me. The soy sauce chicken rice. Okay, average. You actually finished it. Because I didn't like wasting food and we should not waste food. Very so good. That has been, you know, mm, very, very good. That has been my thing. Yeah. Okay. You should not waste food. And um, the last chicken piece is left. Now, besides Hawker Chan, there are a lot of food outlets here in the food court and uh, selling various uh, 
types of Asian cuisine. So feel free that in, in case you're not craving for some Michelin food, you'll get literally any type of Asian food on the food court here in Chinatown. Well, that's all we have for you guys. We hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, now is the right time to hit that like, share and subscribe button. Until we see you again with many more fascinating videos, this is Meryl from the Living Jet Setters signing off.